Have you noticed that your beard looks longer in the morning? Does it mean that your beard grows faster at night? In this video, we're gonna go through the science and what actually happens. Do you wake up in the morning and think to yourself, my beard is definitely way longer now than it was last night? Well, your beard may or may not be growing faster at night. And in this video, we're gonna go through the science so you know if that's true or not. This video is based on an article on beardgrowingpro.com. So go check that out. I have all of the links to all of the science so that you can go and investigate further. Go check it out. All right, does your beard grow faster at night? Let's have a look. I think as beard growers, we are all really tuned in to what our beard is doing at any given time. And so, you know, no one judges our beard more than us. We also notice every single little change, whether it's fluffy here, whether or not it's going gray, whether or not it's straggly or dry or, you know, all of those things. But some people think that your beard grows faster at nighttime and that can be for a variety of reasons. Maybe they wake up and their beard is bushier. Maybe they wake up and they've noticed that where they've shaved is really stubbly. And if they do the same shave at the beginning of the day, that, you know, the, there's not much growth at the end of the day, but overnight, that's where it all happens. So there's all of these observations that we as bearded people are like, does this actually mean my beard is growing more at night? So what I did is I looked at the science and I was looking for testosterone production, beard growth, and also the, how that relates sort of like intimately with your metabolism. So here's what the science says. And if you want more links to more science, head over to Beard Growing Pro. I'll link the article in the description so you can go and essentially explore it all for yourself. But here's what I found, is there was a study and what they looked at was sleep deprivation and beard hair growth. So exactly what we want to know. And they found that if you are sleep deprived for about 48 hours, that your beard growth decreases by 19%. Now what this tells us is that your beard growth is intimately related with the quality, the long, ongoing and long-term quality of your sleep. So if you are not getting very much sleep, you could be seeing a nearly 20% decrease in your beard growth. And if you sort of stretch that out for a long period of time, it can definitely have an impact. So this study does seem to support the fact that your beard relies on good sleep. Now what it doesn't tell us is whether or not your beard grows more at night. And so I found another study that looked at testosterone. And I know that you can't directly say that higher testosterone turns into a higher amount of beard because there's a number of steps that turns testosterone into DHT via an enzyme. And then of course it needs to have an impact on your hair, on your face. So, you know, there's a few steps, but I think monitoring testosterone is a really great way and an easy way to see if uh, sleep would potentially affect beard growth. And what they found is that the uh, testosterone increases with sleep, and also you get a peak of testosterone over your first rapid eye movement. So sleep is split up into all of these different sections, but the most important one for your beard is the rapid eye movement sleep. And that is where we see a peak of testosterone, which is exactly what we want. Now, sleep, uh, does have to be continuous and it has to be good quality sleep. And they found that you need to sleep for at least three hours with a normal sleep pattern to see an increase associated with sleeping. So an increase of testosterone. Um, so there's no doubt that uh, testosterone is intimately related with the quality and the type and the longevity of the sleep that you're able to get but it still doesn't directly answer the question, like does your beard grow more at night, whether or not, you know, testosterone or otherwise? And I couldn't find any specific studies on that, but I will tell you that there are studies about testosterone and the fact that during the day, testosterone sort of like peaks every 90 minutes or so. So 
uh, testosterone production is better during the day than it is at night. So there is no real sort of kind of evidence to suggest that your beard grows faster at night, but we do know that if you don't get good quality sleep, your beard growth is severely impacted up to about 20%. So I think the science is clear in terms of sleep and testosterone and sleep and beard growth, but one thing I realized is that your beard growth is intimately related with your metabolism. So your metabolism really is a measure of how quickly your body is running, you know, whether or not you're revving the guts out of your body and you're kind of, you know, using all of the energy reserves or whether or not you're kind of sluggish and you need a tune up. Like that is what metabolism rates will tell us. And so I found a study that looked at the sort of different metabolic rates while you are awake and when you are asleep. And so what they did is they took these participants and they put them in a large sealed room and measured the amount of oxygen that was they consumed as well as the amount of carbon dioxide that was released. And what they found is kind of supporting what we know about testosterone and sleep is that you have a higher metabolic rate during the rapid eye movement part of your sleep. And so it makes sense therefore that your body is working harder and therefore the growth rate of your beard or any biological process going on in your body would be slightly improved during the rapid eye movement sleep. Um, and also light is a really, really important thing. So there was a 2018 study that looked at the effect of light on metabolism and they found that you know night shift workers had loads of metabolic disorders because they were exposed to light when it should be dark. So I think that if you are in a room where you get a lot of like external light, I think your metabolism or your, you know, your ability to sleep well throughout the light uh, throughout the night does depend completely on the amount of light that kind of comes in through your eyelids. So I think this sort of study tells us that Light is a very important part and you need to make sure that not only you're getting good quality sleep, but you're getting the sort of sleep where it's um, uninterrupted with sounds, light or otherwise. And then your metabolic rate will kind of be normal, which will mean that your beard and other biological processes will be better. So yes, metabolism does increase during rapid eye movement, which relates to the study that we know about testosterone. So it kind of fits together to say once again that the quality of your sleep does severely impact the beard growth, but not that your beard grows quicker at night. I hope that makes sense. But yeah, that was all of the study uh, and the science that I could find around this specific topic. So let me know in the comments if you have got a different observation or if you know of a different study, um, because that's really interesting to me. And I think it's good to answer these sorts of questions with actual facts rather than kind of anecdotal uh, evidence all the time. So yeah, that's, uh, that's it. So why would your beard potentially look longer in the morning? I think that's an important thing to talk about right now. So I think, you know, it's reasonable that when people wake up, they go, oh, my beard is definitely longer. And uh, I think it's because it grows quicker at night but it could be for a whole variety of other reasons. So the first thing is as you're sleeping, if you're a rough sleeper, you may just be fluffing up your beard. Like my beard looks absolute rubbish in the morning. And so when it's fluffy, it may look like it's bigger and bushier, but it's not until you kind of brush it into shape or you get your um, straighteners or your hair dryer and then you can really sort of decide whether or not your hair is genuinely longer or whether or not it's just kind of like a bit of an illusion. So there's the first thing is your hair may just be a little bit fluffy and unkempt in the morning, which gives it the impression that it's kind of grown loads overnight. The second reason why your beard may look as if it's grown more at night is it's flat. So it's kind of the opposite side. If you sleep on one side of your face rather than the other, or you're a very kind of heavy sleeper, you may just flatten one side of your face. And because beard hair is curly, it kind of bushes out. And if it's flat, it may look longer. You know, one side may look longer, it may look longer uh, in terms of where it is in relation to your shoulders or neck. And so, yeah, it could be the other side where in fact, 
sleeping makes your beard look longer, but then when you wash it and blow dry it and do all your normal daily maintenance, it may just end up being normal. So there we have the reasons why your beard may look as if it's growing longer and also the science. I think in summary, the science is telling us that sleep is a very important aspect of growing a beard. So you need to make sure that you get good quality uninterrupted sleep in a dark room, which helps increase your metabolism, reduces uh, sleep disorders, and it means that you get the three hours that this study recommends of uninterrupted normal pattern sleep. So you enter that rapid eye movement sleep regularly, and then your beard will grow quicker. But there is no evidence to suggest that your beard grows quicker at night rather than the daytime. And in fact, I think the science is showing that there's nine, every 90 minutes during the day, your testosterone kind of boosts. And that is where the majority of your beard growth could potentially happen. So still a little bit sort of gray area, but I think this one is a little bit busted in terms of, yeah, you know, sleep is important, but it doesn't make your beard grow faster at night. Yes, I think that's good. All right, so if this video is useful to you, remember to hit that like button, subscribe, share it because that helps me a lot. And I wanna share all of the real information about beards and not just, you know, anecdotal stuff. So thank you so much. Uh, let me know in the comments what you would add to this video and I shall see you in the next one.